Good morning, friends. Let's get ready for our day. I just woke up and I have a lot to do today. You're gonna help me. But first, we're gonna get ready for our day. Also, thanks to EOS for sponsoring this portion of this video. Today, I wanna to share with you the EOS 24 hour moisture body lotion. You guys, the EOS body lotion is the definition of bang for your buck because it's such high quality and it feels elevated, but it's under $8 and you guys can get it now at Walmart. You guys believe this big bottle of Lux body lotion is under $8? This is a deal. This is a deal. EOS body lotion is a best kept secret if you have dry skin, especially this time of year. 24 hour moisture plus soothing protection for dry skin. It is intentionally made with ingredients like shea oil and shea butter. They work hard to moisturize your skin. It's conveniently available in four different scents at Walmart, including the new fragrance Fresh and Cozy. So honey, do not walk. Run to your local Walmart and try it out first. EOS body lotions have unique to die for fragrances that are luxe honey and they can also be layered with your daily perfume. My favorite is vanilla cashmere. I literally smell like a walking snack. Ooh, and they just came out with a new fragrance. It's called Fresh and Cozy. Another favorite that's super sweet is the pomegranate raspberry divine you guys have got to get into these so don't forget to check them out at your local walmart and we are now ready for the day thank you to eos for sponsoring that portion of today's video now that i'm all freshly moisturized gotta run some errands and then i've got to clean up because my house has been a mess for a minute now and i just need to get some stuff done while i have time this morning and i figure i would do it with you then i have to get ready i'll have to pause vlogging for a little bit because i have an event tonight i gotta go to so uh i always take my hair up and down all day up and down up and down i also need to wash my hair but i'm gonna slick my hair like do a side part tonight and like slick it down so i'm not gonna wash it because i'm gonna put a ton of product in it later so we're gonna wash it tomorrow night <laughs> whenever my hair is clean and fresh and i put all that effort in after washing it i don't like to immediately do like a slick look because i put all the product in it and then it's just like dirty again after that so i'm like you know i try to get a few good days with it looking good and down and then after it's like dirty and i i just load it with product and do a little more fun hairstyles with it at that point plus like dirty hair works better you know what i mean i need to get a workout in i just don't know if i'm gonna be able to execute that in time like i would ideally like to run for a minute on my treadmill or something just to get some cardio get something going get the blood flowing but i just don't know if i'm gonna have time because we got a lot of stuff to do today but let's get going let's go to the grocery store i've already had a little bit of breakfast get these groceries going baby and then we're gonna come home we're gonna clean we're gonna do my laundry and it's gonna be a good day. We're gonna have a good day. All right, vlog fam, I am off to the grocery store. We literally have no groceries. Do you ever have those moments where you're like, there's no food in the house? By the way, it is so much better for me to vlog in this car. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna try not never to vlog in my car again because it gets way too loud because I was watching the footage back last time and I was like, oh. I actually had to cut out like most of what I said because I was like, well, they can't hear me. I'm going to the grocery store to grab, you know, the goods. I get so tired of eating out, but it's hard to cook when you don't have any groceries in the house. I feel like I have to go to the grocery store at least once a week. There's a lot of people out there that love grocery shopping. By the way, it is 7.50 in the morning right now. But anyways, there's a lot of people out there that love grocery shopping. I am not one of them. And sometimes I order the groceries to the house, but... You really don't get good produce when you do that. I'm gonna have to go myself. It's definitely worth it. That's gonna be our little adventure today. Also, I'm wearing my favorite sweatshirt. If you've seen me wear this gray crew neck sweatshirt a hundred times, it's because it's my favorite. And I don't get to wear it during the summer, obviously, because it's like 100 degrees out here. We are entering fall, and I'm gonna have my little moment in my favorite sweatshirt. <laughs> Hopefully these sunglasses don't look crazy on me. I'm always a little self-conscious. I'm really tired today. I've been on the go. I didn't get home till late last night, like around 10.30, which is late for me. Okay, I went to bed like at 1, and then I got up at 7, so I feel like I'm going to be tired today. I normally go to bed at like 11, 12, somewhere in there. October, or in like towards the holidays, it's always a little more hairy. I'm supposed to go to a thing tonight too as well, like an event. So it's going to be busy season, honey. So I like to get up earlier and go to the grocery store because at lunchtime they kind of fill up and get busy because people like to take over the deli section to get their lunch really quick. Um, you gotta remember there's like 23 million people in LA. Most states in this country doesn't even have that many people in it. The city I grew up in my whole life had only 
only 200,000 people in it, okay? So you, you really have to work around things in LA to get, to make things happen, you know what I mean? And you learn that really quickly when you move here. <laughs> Bless me. So whenever I moved here, you learn very quickly you can't just be willy-nilly in all over town. You know, you gotta you gotta plan it out. So the grocery store I like to go to in the morning, but the downside of that is traffic in the morning. But whenever schools are out, you, you would be shocked how much less morning traffic there is. You might wouldn't be shocked because that makes sense actually. Anyways, I'm I'm in traffic right now trying to go to the grocery store because it's early and people going to work and here I am trying to go to the grocery store. They're like, girl, stay home. But I'm trying to be the crowd and then the grocery store stores in the afternoon are really busy because people are off work. So I try to shop with the grandmas and the pawpaws at 7 a.m. Anyways, that's my story. I also need to make a nail appointment and do a workout, do my laundry, groceries, I need to clean up in general. I hired my assistant, I told you guys that. She's been helping me a literal ton. I just got a little this and a little that to do and I'm vlogging today, of course, and then I'm gonna edit this vlog as well. We got a lot of things going on, Heeny. We have broccoli, bananas, tomatoes, avocados, one onion. We have some garlic up in here. And I love apples, so I got some apples. Every time I refill his cat food, he thinks it's time to eat. It's not, get off the counter. How did I end up with this much laundry? I haven't done laundry in like three weeks, so we're about to do my laundry. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, guys, I just got back from the event and I'm about to like relax and take a bath and call it an evening, but it was super fun. My belt's all messed up. This was straight like that. <laughs> um, but I'm about to chill out and like take a bath, take off all this makeup, take off all this jewelry and call it a night because your girl is really, really tired now. And I'm gonna get ready for bed. It's like 11 o'clock. I don't stay out too late, you know? It's like a, it's like a Tuesday. We don't wanna get crazy up in here. Oh, yeah. 